gosh, I hate this feeling. Raw, oh yeah, I saw the raw underground. That looked like garbage. Jeez, that was fast. <laughs> oh yeah, YouTuber Steve, you know me. So Taurus, what's going on? You missed us finishing the end of Gale of Darkness. Don't worry though. We will be going all through Gale of Darkness Battle Tower eventually. But we finished the story part of it. Oh, Ribbon Quest, need a good Zapdos, Battle Tower Cruel. I understand. Oh, <gasps> Shiny Pikachu in one encounter. Well, minus the one encounter we did with Rare Bird, but this was my raid. Shiny Pikachu. <laughs> Pika. <laughs> oh my goodness. Watch us fail it. I told you guys, gotta smash, smash that bell. <laughs> oh gosh. Holy mill tank. All right, everyone who joined this raid. I think Vince is in here. I don't know who else is in here though. You're not allowed to join any of my raids. You gotta let other people have opportunities. Of course I miss your ram. <laughs> Sorry, rare bird. <laughs> it did fill up very fast though. What if I don't catch it? Use repeat ball. Oh, what if I don't catch it? Uh oh. I didn't think about this. I want to. I don't want to use repeat ball. It's promoted. I don't know what the catch rate on this is. Wait, did that did that data miner say what the catch rate was? Oh man, I want shiny Pikachu and a cool ball. Wait, is it a boy or a girl? Check its tail. Oh yeah, it's a boy. <laughs> it's tail, duh. I'm not gonna waste a master ball on it. What are the odds? One in one in thirteen is the odds. No, sorry. Two in twenty-five. Wait, though, that's the same as one in thirteen. Never mind. <laughs> one in thirteen does not equal two in twenty-five. What? Yeah, it does. You just gotta round you're rounding up for the one in thirteen. What do you want me to actually say one in twelve point five? Let's pretend that this is just a wild Pikachu. If it's a wild Pikachu at level 60, which it is, and it has one HP, which it does, with a Pokeball, it is a 78% chance to be, be caught. If this was just a wild Pikachu. Now, if I was to use an Ultra Ball, it would say it would be 100%. If I was to use a Love Ball, which I think I can use, because my Boofalant is a female. It's still 78%. I don't know why that is. Yeah, Repeat Ball for me says 100%. I think only... Oh, yeah. Love Ball only works if you're the same Pokemon. Master Ball is 100%. Yeah, I know that Dusk and Repeat have higher dense cool dude. What do you think? I I only have 800 hours in this game. Of course I know that. I don't want to use Repeat Ball. There's always four more days. You'll find another. Isn't Pikachu male because yeah, the Pikachu's male. Did I do luxury? Luxury would look good. Luxury is an it is a 79% chance. That's a four in five chance chat. It's a one in five chance it fails. Oh gosh, I hate this feeling. <sighs> Got you. Put that wallet away. Hey, we caught Shiny Pikachu. Your noises that close to the mic? 100% chance it works three fourths of the time. Name him Gail. <laughs> All that stress for an easy capture. Who was all in that raid? It was Fresh, Waffles, and... Or, sorry, Fresh, Vince, and who else was in that raid? Are Pichu odds boosted? No, just Pikachu. Just Pikachu, chat. Pikachu, only 5-star Pikachu, that's it. 5%. 
or eight percent sorry Pikachu to you too it will always have this move set too these the shiny Pikachus will not know surf we all share similarities and I know like you guys and like me you don't want to give your money to GameStop I understand I am the same boat GameStop will fail it'll be a great day I feel bad for everyone that lose their, loses their job, unfortunately. But some companies need to crumble. That being said, GameStop does have pre-orders open for Champion's Path. If you want to at least ensure... Five-star Pikachu! All right, if you, were, if you were in the last ones, again, do not join. I want to get at least a full rotation of people. They're becoming Dave and Busters? <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> Anyways, um, if you want an elite trainer box, at least this morning, as I showed Atrocious, uh, GameStop is still taking pre-orders for Champion's Path. You can ship it right to your house. You don't have to go into a GameStop. They won't ask you to pre-order the latest version of Madden. That's what I did. Uh, Risk Goblin, thank you for the follow. Knowing games, knowing GameStop, they're gonna cancel your order like two days before it ships. Actually, is what's gonna happen. The problem is until any other company reliably sells used games, GameStop isn't going anywhere. That's far from true. Uh, GameStop has like not turned a profit in the last several years. Also, the company that currently owns GameStop is the same company that owned Toys R Us. So uh, it's not a question of if GameStop is going to go out of business. It's a question of when GameStop will go out of business. Because they will shut down GameStop. Second shiny Pikachu! Two out of three! <laughs> it's a girl! Oh, I gotta catch it in a luxury ball, right? Why did you fire me? Rigged. Hey, thanks, Polywagger. Yeah, I need to catch in a luxury ball. We need to have a matching set. They need to be husband and wife. What are the odds? If you're the host, it should be 100% with an Ultra Ball, Lucas. If you're a guest, the odds are like 50% or something. Two out of three odds confirmed. <laughs> Who do we turn to for used games? Um, eBay, DK Oldies, Mon Pa stores. Facebook Marketplace. Used games is 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 keeping GameStop afloat. Uh, if GameStop wasn't hurting for money, they also wouldn't have argued with the government that they were an essential business and needed to be stay at, stay open when like places like Best Buy and uh, Michaels and Joanne Fabrics were all closing and GameStop got up there and tried to argue that they were an essential business and they needed to stay open. That whole company is such a joke. Um, have a good night, Garrison. The the main re okay, so the main reason that company that bought Toys R Us bought GameStop is to do what they did to GameStop. They're going to squeeze GameStop of every penny they have left. And then the like top 10 people that work at GameStop will get huge payouts. And then every manager and every employee at GameStop will lose their job with like a week's notice. I don't, I don't know if it's going to happen this year or if it's going to happen next year. But that's 100% what's going to happen. Because that's what happened to Toys R Us. What did Toys R Us employees get? They got like two weeks notice. I think somebody in chat did work at Toys R Us. No severance package either? Yeah, no severance package either. Thank you, Traff. You're killing it with clips. Yes. It's more like the Magikarp event. Uh, than the than the Waylord event. But yeah, it's going on all weekend. Yeah, Rare Bird was a Toys R Us employee. I feel bad for the employees, but I'll buy everything they liquidate. 
I was a host of the one before this. It broke out of an Ultra Ball. I'm a guest now, and I was nervous. Wait, it broke out of your Ultra Ball as a host? I got liquidated from Lego from Target. Wait, Lego? Oh, you got liquidated Lego from a Target store. I meant Target, I meant, I meant, oh, Toys R Us. Okay, yeah, I was like, wait, Target didn't liquidate anything. You're very welcome, sweet Lou. Oh my goodness. I got matching sets. I went to Toys R Us when they were closing too. They didn't have anything good, really. I'll have a I'll have a complete infographic for you guys tomorrow. I'll work on it as soon as stream is over, and I'll post it first thing in the morning for you guys. If you want to share it, because there's a lot of, you can see there's a lot of questions about how this event works. So I'll have a new graphic up on Instagram and on Twitter tomorrow, and you guys can share it with your friends and stuff. You're very welcome, Shadow.